Somewhere, hidden amongst thorny brambles, is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. <coughs> and I'm Princess Holly. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> Ben and Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at the Little Castle. The Elf Farm. Nanny Plum, where's breakfast? So sorry, Your Majesty, but the elves haven't delivered the food yet. A boiled egg is all I want, Nanny. Can't you just magic one? I could magic an egg, of course. But real farm eggs taste much better. I don't care. I'm hungry and I would like an egg now. Very well, Your Majesty. Abracadabra. Uh, boiled eggy. Ugh. Ooh, smelly. That's disgusting. What is it? It's a dragon's egg. Well, get rid of it. I could magic a real chicken to lay an egg for you. No, don't. I think I'll wait for the elf farm delivery. It might take some time, Your Majesty. I am not leaving this table until I've had my egg. As you wish, Your Majesty. <coughs> Nanny, they're here. <laughs> <coughs> Food delivery! What kept you, Mr Elf? King Thistle is waiting for his breakfast. Sorry, Nanny Plum. We dropped a carrot on the way and had to go back to pick it up. OK. Let's get this food into the castle. Carrot, tomato, small lettuce. Oh, but where's the egg? <gasps> the egg? That's the one thing we need. The king wants an egg. We'll go straight back to the elf farm and get one. Holly, do you want to come with us? Yes, please. Nanny, can I go to the elf farm? OK, Holly. You can make sure we get a good egg. That buzzing noise. I hope it's not the engine. It's Gaston the Ladybird. Gaston, we're going to the elf farm. Do you want to come along? Old elf. Hello, Princess Holly. Welcome to the elf farm. <laughs> you must wear this hard hat. What for? In case something falls on your head. Ooh. This way to the carrots. <laughs> this is the carrot field. Ooh. Princess Holly. Hello, Mrs. Elf. <laughs> this way. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> this is the lettuce patch. Ooh. Clear the area. Clear the area. Clear the area. Clear the area. Why have you got an umbrella? We are going to make it rain. With magic. You don't need magic if you have a big watering can. Wow. Push, 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 That's amazing. 
amazing. <laughs> <laughs> if you think that's amazing, wait until you see the tomato plants. Ooh. These are the tomato plants. Wow. I'm afraid we have tomato bugs. Oh, dear. Tomato bugs like to eat the tomato plants. Go away. Shoo, 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 shoo. Oh, they keep coming back. Yes, if only we could find a way to get rid of them. Gaston scared them away. Of course. Ladybirds like to eat tomato bugs. Clever, Gaston. You should be our chief pest controller. <laughs> <laughs> now we can harvest a tomato. Carry on. Right-o. Tomato! <laughs> that looks dangerous. It is. That's why we wear these hard hats. But there's another job that's really dangerous. Ooh, what's that? Can I see? It can be quite scary. I'm not afraid. It is possibly the most dangerous job in the world for an elf. What is it? Collecting eggs. What's so dangerous about collecting eggs? Chickens. <laughs> Wow, they're big, aren't they? Yes, that's why we have this high fence. And why it's very important to lock this gate. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, exciting! Wait, <laughs> Princess Holly! These chickens don't look dangerous. It's collecting eggs that's dangerous. How do you collect an egg? An elf must run very quickly to the egg, pick it up and run away with it as quick as they can. What happens if they're not quick enough? They get sat on. <laughs> oh, dear. Now you see how important it is that the gate is locked at all times. A chicken's escaped! Catch that chicken! <laughs> chicken's escaped! Follow that chicken. Clockwork has wound down. Quick, Holly, let's wind it up. Oh, hello. Will somebody give me an egg? Now! Goodness me! Nanny Plum, I told you not to magic a chicken. That's not my chicken. Nanny, can you speak chicken? Yes, Your Majesty. So, what did it say? Mrs Chicken said... Oh. Look, there's our chicken. Careful, Nanny Plum. That 
is a dangerous animal. Don't be silly. It's just a chicken. <laughs> the chicken's laid an egg. Hooray! Hooray! Mmm, yes. A much better service than the elf truck. <laughs> what? Nanny Plum, could you ask Mrs Chicken to deliver an egg for breakfast tomorrow? Certainly, Your Majesty. Ahem. Somewhere, hidden amongst thorny brambles, is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. <coughs> and I'm Princess Holly. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> Ben and Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at the Little Castle. Holly's Magic Wand. Ah, what a lovely morning for a bit of wand practice. But Nanny Plum... I was going to play with Ben. Princess Holly, there's a time for playing with elves and a time for wand practice. Please, Nanny. I promise to practice later. Mm, very well, but come in when I... Thanks, Nanny. Bye. <laughs> Oh, well, I suppose I could do some wand practice while I wait. Now, wand, what shall we do today? Yes, let's make a pretty hat. Abracazat, a pretty hat. Oh, it's not very pretty. And it's too big. Bye-bye, silly hat. Hi, Holly. Hi, Ben. I'm practising my magic. Do you want to see? Uh, OK. Stand very still. I'll make you a new hat. Abracazat, magic Ben a hat. Oh. Ben, are you in there? Oh, it's empty. I've turned Ben into a hat. Gosh, what a big hat. Uh, it's Ben. I accidentally turned him into a hat. Princess Holly, that's exactly why you need to practice your magic more. I was practising, but it all went a bit wrong. I expect you waved your wand all over the place. I tried waving it right, but this wand is no good. Now, now, a good fairy never blames her wand. Yes, Nanny Plum. I've a good mind to leave Ben as a hat, just to teach you a lesson. <coughs> Please turn Ben back, Nanny. I don't think he likes being a hat. <laughs> oh, very well. Watch and learn. Ding dong den, hat to Ben. What happened? Uh, things went a bit wrong, but Nanny Plum came to the rescue. Thank you, Nanny Plum. You're welcome, Ben. Now, Holly, next time, shake the wand gently. Yes, Nanny. Sorry, Ben. Were you scared? I'm an elf. Elves are never scared. <laughs> Good. In that case, can I try again? Um, maybe later. See you. Bye, Ben. <laughs> Dee-dee-da, 
dum dee dum dee do dee dee do dum dee dum dee do <laughs> Princess Holly, what have you forgotten? Uh, your wand. Where is it? Oh, I don't seem to have it. You haven't lost it, have you? Oh, I know. I left it in the meadow. I'm sure I left my wand here. It's gone! <laughs> Hi, Holly! <laughs> Hi, Ben. What's wrong? I've lost my wand. I can't do magic anymore. Maybe that's a good thing. <laughs> it's not funny. I'm never going to find my wand and I'll be sad forever. <laughs> Cheer up, Holly. I will find your wand. How? Elves are very good at finding things, and I'm an elf. <laughs> Thanks, Ben. But if I find your wand, you must promise not to turn me into a hat again. I promise. But, Ben, how are you going to find my wand? I've got a simple plan. Oh, goody. <laughs> First, try to remember where you left your wand. In your bedroom, perhaps, or in... There. Oh. That's where I left it. Ah. What's the next bit of your plan? Um, that was the plan. Ah. Oh, I knew I'd never find it. <coughs> oh, look, it's Gaston the ladybird. Maybe he can help. Hi, Gaston. <coughs> Can you help us find Holly's wand? It was here, and now it's not. <laughs> Gaston's good at smelling things. He'll find your wand in no time. Clever, Gaston. <laughs> oh. Why has Gaston stopped? He's looking up into the sky. So that's where your wand has gone. How? Um, can your wand fly? My wand is magic, but I don't think it can fly. Well, it's up there somewhere. If only it could talk to us and tell us where it is. That's easy. It can't talk, but it can make a sort of tinkly sound. Great! Could you call to it? OK. Wand! I oh, wand! That's my wand! It's coming from up there! It's a jackdaw! And it's got my wand! Jackdaws like shiny things! It's very high up! And I'm not allowed to fly high! No problem! I'll climb up! Be careful, Ben! Don't worry, Holly! Elves are very good at climbing, and I'm an elf. <coughs> nice birdie. Can we have our wand back, please? <coughs> you, that was lucky. Wow, Ben. Tricking the jackdaw to open its mouth. I would never have thought of that. Uh, yes. Elves are very good at that sort of thing. <laughs> ah, ah. We should go before the jackdaw works out what to do next. OK. Giddy up, Gaston! Giddy up! Giddy up! <laughs> Ben found my wand. That's very nice, but you really shouldn't have lost it in the first place. Yes, Nanny Plum. Now, Ben, I understand we have you to thank for finding Holly's wand. <laughs> it was 
nothing, really. I think a reward is in order. I hear you want a new magic hat. Um... Yes, it can be my thank you to Ben. No, please, don't bother. Stay very still, Ben. And Holly, wave the wand gently. Yes, Nanny Plum. Abracazette, Magic Ben, a hat. Wow, it worked. It's all down to wand control. <laughs> and it's a nice cowboy hat. Ben, thanks for finding my wand. Sorry I didn't believe your plan would work. And I'm sorry I didn't trust your magic hat spell. Oh, no. The magic hat has turned Ben blue. How do I look? Um, I think your old hat suits you better. Me too. Abracazobody. Ah, oh, it's good to have my old hat back again. And it's nice to have you back, Wand. I will never lose you again. Ha, 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 ha